Good morning, Fenlanders. How are we doing? I'm Daniel Welton, Fenland Farm Adventures. That's Grumpy Grandad. Let's try that again. Good morning, everyone. Or good evening, everyone. I'm Daniel Welton, Fenland Farm Adventures. Grumpy Grandad's just putting boxes away. Man, it is a humdinging cold out here this morning. Uh, there's a wind out as well, which makes it even colder. Um, great day yesterday. Well done to all the organisers who organised uh, a protest against um, Labour and all their <laughs> decisions. Um, I only saw two politicians there yesterday. One of them was Nigel Farage, who gets my vote. And the other one was a disgruntled Labour MP who um, thought the government had got it completely wrong. And uh, she'd be right. We've got potatoes to do. Taters to do, boy. So, we'll get on and do that. I mean, it's lovely and warm in here. Oh, uh, no, 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 no. I've got some more heaters to pick up from my good friend Darren. He uh, has been a legend. And um, had a look at my heaters for me and got them working, which is great. What does the temperature gauge say? Ah, zero degrees, but feels like minus 337. Grumpy Grandad has got a thing for uh, wearing his gloves in the truck. And uh, also, he's got a fetish for uh, smearing his hand across the inside of the window when it's misted up a bit. Rather than putting a demister on and the air con and just leaving it for a minute, he's got a little fetish for uh, rubbing his hands all over me window. So, I will uh, clean the inside of my window before I have an accident and uh, and get that done. I've been to Ben Burgess this morning, got myself some fancy new overalls. 6R250 incoming. Yeah, get a new pair of overalls or a new tractor. So, just waiting for him to come out and tell me one, really. Um, would be lovely, wouldn't it? God, imagine that. I'd be well, like, tickled pink. And a 6R250. It'd be interesting to put a 6R250 against a fast track. I don't think the 215... Although they say they're supposed to be the same horsepower, I don't think my 215 pulls as well as it should. Um, yeah, so that'd be interesting to put them two against each other, wouldn't it? Deck weight on the fast track and get at it. Get at it. Um, so yeah, I got a filter that I can't get in on this bloody tractor. So that's why I went to Ben Burgess more than anything, is to do that. So let me clean my window. I bought him glass cleaner as well bought him loads of glass cleaner to stop that and uh, it doesn't seem to be happening nice smear free window what does everybody else use I, I am fairly well tickled pink with this um, auto glim stuff or oh, no auto smart sorry auto smart that seems to be the best stuff so far I've found just rub it on let it dry and then rub it off good clean window when I'm cleaning windows. Oh, we like to keep at the top of our game when it comes to content, don't we? Me in here cleaning my bloody window. And then I bought some diesel treatment stuff for my uh, 6170 as well. Because that didn't seem like it was pulling like it should. So, let's go and put that in. It didn't seem like it was pulling like it should. And, uh, yeah, I weren't overly happy with it. So I got some of this. Anybody else use that? Ow. Uh, everything cold, everything miserable. But I love it. I love a bit of farming. It was nice to meet so many fans there yesterday. Please forgive me, I've forgotten absolutely everyone's name. Uh, it was nice to, nice to meet Russell and, and Matthew. Um, all of my friends and stuff that are local to here. That good to show their support at Labour doing a job. Not only are they doing a crap job when it comes to their uh, inheritance tax. You know, I'm gonna spend my whole life paying for this farm uh, to get somewhere, try and make myself a bit better and maybe leave it to some kids if I ever have any kids or, or um, a baby I borrowed from eBay. Um, or my sister's kids or anything like that, you know? And uh, 
I'm going to spend my whole life paying for it, and then I'm going to, they're going to spend their whole lives paying for the inheritance on it. I'm going to spend my whole life paying for the inheritance, as well as trying to pay for the, trying to pay for the farm, and then the inheritance tax if anything happens to mum and dad. It's their farm, not mine. I just make it awesome. But yeah, it just, um, it don't make any sense. It really doesn't make any sense. And, and Labour are coming in now with carbon tax on fertiliser. Well, shove it. You just shove that right where the sun don't shine. You want food, let's grow food. Now we've got no steel industry. We're gonna have to import steel. It don't make any sense why you would do cut your, spite your face to cut your nose off or whatever it is. I can't remember how it goes, I'm a bit delirious. So that's the 170 done with a little diesel treatment. I'll fill this up with diesel once I, uh... but it was all caked up with crap and stuff. So, I mean, the filters got changed in 2022, but the back end have been changed since 2021. So, um, it was it was long overdue a service. Um, a six six ten is long overdue a service as well. So we'll uh, I'll get Grumpy Grandad around here, and he will help me try and get the. Uh, we'll just grind some off that little filter that we're we're struggling with. So see you guys in a minute. Right, Grumpy Grandad now going out to do a load of muck. Um, this is how back to front my brain is at the minute. Grumpy Grandad, I'll leave the tractor there for a minute. Grumpster's now going to pick up a load of boxes that we lent out for pumpkins, of all things. So, while he's doing that, I'll get this old fast track fired up, this old clunker. Oh man, alive, it is cold out here. And then after that, we're going to do some potatoes, yay! That's me load of muck done. Jobs are given. He, uh, I forgot the uh, pig units. Doggy time, my favorite time. After eating steaks and uh, street food and stuff uh, in London for the last few days, Nutty Nana's gonna have a hard job uh, living up to a ham sandwich, isn't she? So. So we're going to get some lunch and then we're going to crack on and do some spurs. Now it's warmed up a little bit. Oh, say can you see a nail in the floor? Forgot what I was going to say now. I really have. Um, yeah, mega day yesterday. It was really good to see all the support and uh, all the locals and stuff. I forgot Luke Clements earlier. I saw him and his daughters. So. That was nice to see them. They're getting stuck into the farm. They're loving life. So, hello to them. I can't remember what their names are. Forgive me. Um, put the dirty pair of gloves in me pocket, which are covered in oil. Me, uh, me air horns are not working. So you know how uh, <laughs> off I am that my air horns are not working. I think they need. Somebody said they need lubricating. So maybe they're just a bit seized up. So hopefully I'll get them sorted at some point as well. I need to make a little cover for them all the relays on top of it as well so get our spuds done and then i don't really never know what i'm gonna do after that try and get that filter in cheers guys Today's video, guys, is sponsored by Fenlander Clothing. If you need to keep your bubble head warm, go and get yourself a bubble hat. So everything, I think, is working okay now. Really 
glad I don't have to do much of that. 